shadows appear And hope is obscured by the tears in my eyes When faith turns to fear And dark clouds of worry arise When I turn to run And there is nowhere to hide you are one Close to my side You are the light in my dark You are the cry in my heart You are the rest in the storm You are the way that leads on You are the light like a child I get distracted and wander away but your touch is kind and back in your arms I am safe and though I am small you never laugh at me when I fall down but love through it all Counting each tear is your own You are the light in my dark You are the cry in my heart You are the rest in the storm You are the way in the Praise the Lord, praise. Magandang umaga po mga magulang at kapatid. Sa ilang saglit lamang po, magkumabisa na po ang ating uh, gawain. Mangyari po na magsetang down na po ang bawat isa. Amen. Panatilingin po natin ang kakaibigan sa ating uh, worship hall. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. God is good. And all the time. Amen. Magandang umaga po sa ating nag-iisang Diyos na buhay. Amen. Praise God. Kamusta na po ang bawat isa? Are you blessed? 
Amen. Praise the Lord. Ang sabi po ng Panginoon, God said in Matthew 11 verse 28, Come unto me, O ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Amen. Sabi po ng Panginoon mismo, magsiparito kayo sa akin, kayong lahat na nangapapagal at nangabibigit ang lukha, kayo'y aking papangpahingan. Amen. Praise the Lord. Sino po dito ang bibigatin? May mga problema. May mga pinagdadaan ng trials. Sino dito na nga napapagal? You came to the right place, mga magulang at kapatid. Nandito po tayo ngayon sa tahanan ng Panginoon upang tayo po ay mag-recharge. At humingi po ng habag sa Panginoon na i-renew po ng Panginoon ang bawat isa. At tatandaan po natin, kung tayo po ilalapit sa Panginoon, hindi niya po tayo pababayaan. Amen? Kung mayroon man po tayong mga bigatin, idulog po natin sa Panginoon and God will never fail us. Amen po ba? Amen. So let us draw near to our Lord Jesus Christ. Tayo po ito mayo. I-welcome po natin ang presensya ng ating Panginoon. Pangungunahan po tayo ng buong praise and worship team. Ibigay po ni Sister JM ang meditation. At ang opening prayer naman po ibigay ni Brother Archie. Isang malakas na palakpak po sa ating nag-iisang Diyos na buhay. Isang napakagandang umaga po sa ating lahat at sa ating Diyos na buhay din po. At nawa po sana na purihin natin ang ating Panginoon at buong puso po natin ibigay ang lahat-lahat po natin upang purihin natin siya. Draw me close to you Never let me go I lay it all down again To hear you say that I'm You are my desire No one else will do Cause nothing else could take a place To feel the warmth of your Help me find a way, bring me back to you. Warmth of your grace. Help me 
find the way. Help me find the way. Lord, bring me back to you. Praise Him to the Lord, hallelujah, Jesus, praise Him, worship Him, oh Lord Jesus, hallelujah, you're the creator of heaven and earth, hallelujah, Jesus, you're the God of Isaac, Abraham, and Jacob, hallelujah, Jesus, oh Lord, hallelujah, Jesus, ikaw lang pinapupurian namin sa umaga ito, ikaw ang Diyos na banal, ang Diyos na hindi nagbabago, noon, ngayon magpakailaman, oh Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. We thank you, O Lord, for this opportunity, O Lord, to praise you. We worship you, O Lord, in your spirit and truth. Hallelujah, Jesus. O Lord, kami nagpapakumbaba sa umagang ito. Humingi kami ng kapatawaran. Forgive our sins, O Lord. Hallelujah, Jesus. Ito'y nasambit sa isip na gawa. Patawad, O Lord, sa aming nagawa, O Lord, Jesus. Maraming maraming salamat, O Lord, sa apong ito. Amen, Lord. Salat ng tatayo, O Lord, sa iyong banal na sanctuaryo, Hallelujah, Jesus. Bigyan mo ng wisdom and knowledge. Pour out your spirit, O Lord. Sa simula, O Lord, sa MC. Wisdom, O Lord. Knowledge, O Lord, Jesus. Sa operatoria, sir, O Lord. Give also wisdom and knowledge, O Lord, Jesus. Sa IT, sa backup. Music, music, uh, music ministry, O Lord Jesus. Sa live stream, O Lord, ikaw ang gumabay sa kanila upang uh, makapakinig ng iyong banalang salatit sa umagang ito, O Lord Jesus. O Lord, 
Maraming maraming salamat, O Lord, sa privilege na lahat ng mga kapatiran, O Lord, na nandirito sa iyong banal na sanctuaryo upang makapakinig ng iyong banal na salita, O Lord. Rebuke man o pagpapala sa aming mga buhay, O Lord. Ito ay aming tatanggapin sa aming kalooban. Hallelujah, Jesus. O Lord, lahat ng mga kapatiran, O Lord, na parating pa lang, Ikaw ang mag-guide sa kanila na makarating dito na may kagalakan, O Lord, upang makapakinig ng iyong banal na salita. Bigyan mo sila ng spiritual na pandinig, O Lord Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. O Lord, sa lahat na may mga sakit na karamdaman, O Lord, alam po namin, O Lord, You're the great healer. You're the great healer, O Lord. Hallelujah, Jesus, O Lord. Pour out Your Spirit, O Lord. Ayon niya sa iyong banal na salita, to our gathered tree in Your name, O Lord Jesus. You're in our midst, O Lord. Nandito ka sa kaligitnaan namin, O Lord Jesus. O Lord Jesus, Hallelujah, Jesus. O Lord, sa magbibigay ng sayo, O Lord, sa hapong ito, bigyan mo siya ng wisdom and knowledge, O Lord, with power, boldness, O Lord Jesus, na pawang ng gagaling lamang sa O Lord. Alam po namin, O Lord, na hindi mo siya pababayaan, O Lord. Siya ay isang instrumento, O Lord, na upang ipahayag yung banal na salita sa hapong ito, O Lord Jesus. Sa yung uh, sambayan, O Lord, ikaw ang gumabay sa kanila, O Lord. Na may, may kalakasan, O Lord, sa bawat isa, O Lord Jesus. Sa pangaraw, O Lord Jesus. Sa bawat isa, O Lord, we claim the victory, O Lord, sa umagang ito, O Lord Jesus. We claim the victory, O Lord. Hallelujah, Jesus, O Lord Jesus. Ikaw lang, O Lord, we worship you. We magnify your name. We glorify you. Hallelujah, Jesus. We praise you. We magnify you, O Lord Jesus. We praise you. We praise you, O Lord Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. We praise you. We praise you. Hallelujah. Ito lang mga nga samat dalangin, O Lord Jesus. In your name, mighty name, O Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In amen. We praise you, O Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise the Lord. Muli po, a blessed morning po sa ating nag-iisang Diyos na buhay at sa inyo pong lahat. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Kamusta na po ulit? Are you blessed? Parang dito lang sa side na itong narinig ko eh. Dito nga ako pamunta. Are you blessed, church? Amen. Praise the Lord. Tunay po, na mabuti po ang Panginoon na minsan pa we are here gathered to praise and worship our one true God, Jesus Christ. Amen? And He is our main priority today and always. Amen po ba? Amen. Praise the Lord. So, sa pagkakataon po ito, nais nice po natin i-welcome ang ating mga kapatid na sa unang pagkakataon po ay ating makakasama. Amen? Welcome po kay Sister Cherry. Where is Sister Cherry? Amen. Praise God. Welcome, Sister Cherry. Welcome po, Sister Donna. Amen. Praise the Lord. Welcome, Sister Darlene. Where is Sister Darlene? Amen. Praise the Lord. Welcome po sa gawain ng Panginoon. Amen. Praise God. And welcome, Sister Adriana. Anak niyo po. Amen. Praise the Lord. Tunay po na mabuti po ang Panginoon. And welcome back po kay Sister Michelle. Amen. Praise God. Where is Sister Michelle? Amen. Praise the Lord. Also, welcome back, Brother James. Where is Brother James? Amen. Praise God. Amen. Hallelujah. Tunay po na kayo na po ang magpapatotoo kung bakit nandito po kayong muli. Dahil naras, naranasan po ninyo ang kabutihan ng Panginoon. Amen. So sa atin po mga first time visitors, kami po naging bisita rin po kami one time sa buhay namin. At kami na po ang nag-decide na paulit-ulit na bumalik sa gawain ng Panginoon dahil nandito po ang presensya ng Panginoon. Amen po ba? Amen. Praise God. Kaya palakpakan po natin ang ating nag-iisang Diyos na buhay. Amen. And of course, welcome po sa ating mga live streamers. We have live streamer from Qatar. We have Brother Marlon. Amen. From Bahrain, we have Brother Buboy na nasa trabaho. Welcome po from Abu Dhabi. We have Sister Lala Olivar. From Philippines, we have Sister Scarlett. From Philippines, we have Sister Lorraine. From Philippines, we have Brother Sharwin. Amen. 
Malapit na pong bumalik si Brother Sharwin. Amen. Welcome din po from Philippines. We have Sister Mary Ann. From KSA, we have Sister Joy. From USA, we have Sister Harriet. From KSA, we have Brother Wilfredo. From Philippines, we have Sister Rose Brew. Amen. And yung live streamer natin sa Dubai, nandito na Sister Marlene Pangan. Amen. Welcome po. From Dubai to Bahrain. Amen. Nawa po, manatili na po kayo dito sa bansang ito para makasama namin kayo. Amen. Praise God. Mabuti po ang Panginoon sa lahat ng panahon. Amen. Praise God. Tunay po na nandito po tayo ngayon muli upang purihin at sambahin ang ating nag-iisang Diyos. So, sabi nga po natin kanina sa nabasa natin, sabi po ni Lord, Come unto me those who are heavily laden and I will give you rest. Amen. Hindi po ibig sabihin na matutulog kayo ha. Ang lahat ng inaantok magsabing Amen. Praise God. Walang inaantok. Sister Grace. White awake ang lahat. Purihin po ang Panginoon ng aga-aga pa nga naman. Alam nga naman antukin kayo, di ba? So ang araw na ito, we will give it to the Lord. We will give our best to the Master. Amen? So tayo po ay sasayaw, papalakpak ng may kagalakan para sa ating Panginoon. So tayo po ay tumayo, pangungunahan po tayo ng buong praise and worship team mo pang magkamustahan. And of course, we would like to greet belated happy birthday po kay Pastora Lucy. Nagre-replay po sila sa live stream. Belated happy birthday, Brother Laverne, yesterday. And today, happy birthday kay Brother Marcus. Amen. So kapag nilapitan nyo sila, batiin nyo naman sila para siya ay lalong mumiti ng maganda. Amen. Praise God. Palakpakan po natin ang ating Panginoon. Amen. Purihan ng Diyos. At uh, magkumustahan na po tayo mga kapatid. Amen. Habang uh, paumpisa pa lang po ang ating uh, worship, magkumustahan na po ang bawat isa. Amen. Welcome. Lalo-lalo po na yung mga bagong uh, visitor po natin. Amen. Amen. So, napakagandang pagmasdan. Pag tayo po ay sama-samang uh, magbabatian at uh, nagmamahalan at nandun yung kagalakan. Amen. Amen. Puro yan ang Diyos. The heartbeat of our mission To teach in Jesus' name To share His goodness and righteousness Baptized in Jesus' name We worship in the Spirit, we serve with all our hearts, we declare that it's our Savior, we praise Him in what a great commission of our lives, to give salvation to Jesus Christ. Prince of Peace and Counsel, Lord, Everlasting Father, Almighty God. Amen. The heartbeat of our mission. The heartbeat of our mission. To teach in Jesus' name. To share His goodness and righteousness. Baptizing in Jesus' name. We worship in the Spirit. Serve it on our hearts. We declare that it's our Savior. We praise Him in one accord. Great commission of our lives to teach our nation that Jesus Christ brings of peace and counsel, Lord, everlasting Father. Almighty God, great commission, great commission of our lives to teach the nation that Jesus Christ brings of peace and counsel, Lord, everlasting Father. Almighty God, great commission, great commission of our lives to teach the nation that Jesus Christ. Prince of peace and counsel, Lord, everlasting Father, Almighty God, Almighty God, Almighty 
Amen. Amen. Purihin ang Diyos. At tunay nga, um, nakikita sa bawat isa yung kagalakan. Amen. Lalo lang na sa pagpuri sa ating Panginoon at sa pag-welcome sa bawat isa. Nawa po, ang bawat isa ay mabibless sa araw na ito sapagkat we declare na ang ating Panginoon na nasa sa ating kalagitnaan. Amen. Purihin ang Diyos. When the Spirit of the Lord it's in our heart. Amen. Hallelujah. We can dance, we can praise, we can jump. Amen. Name it. Gawin po natin ang narapat para sa ating Panginoon. Hallelujah. When the Spirit of the Lord is in my heart I can praise like David praised when the Spirit of the Lord is in my heart I can praise like David praised I can praise I can praise, O oh Lord, I can praise, O oh Lord, I can praise like David praise. I can praise, O oh Lord, I can praise, O oh Lord, I can praise like David praise. When the Spirit of the Lord is in my heart, I can praise like David praise. When the Spirit of the Lord is in my heart, I can praise like David praise. I can praise, oh Lord, I can praise, oh Lord. I can praise like David praise. I can praise, oh Lord. I can praise, oh Lord. I can praise like David praise. Hallelujah. When the spirit of the Lord is in my heart, I can dance like David dance. When the spirit of the Lord is in my heart, I can dance like David dance. I can dance, oh Lord, I can dance, oh Lord, I can dance like David dance. I can dance, oh Lord, I can dance, oh Lord, I can dance like David dance. When the Spirit of the Lord is in my heart, I can jump like David jump. When the Spirit of the Lord is in my heart, I can jump like David jump. I can jump, oh Lord. I can jump, oh Lord. Amen. I can jump, oh Lord. I can jump, oh Lord. I can jump, oh Lord. I can jump, like David jump. Amen. Bola. Pa paano pa mag jump? Huh? Hindi eh. Hindi synchronize yung pag-jump po ninyo. Ang iba, jump. Ang iba, jump. Jump ba gano'n? <laughs> Ang iba, jump, jump. Dapat sabay-sabay po. Dapat po, pag-jump, jump po tayo. Amen! Amen! Amen. Amen. Naniniwala po ba ang spirit ng ating Panginoon ay nasa sa atin? Amen! Amen! So, gawin po natin. Amen! Hallelujah! I can jump unto the Lord. Amen. When the Spirit of the Lord is in my heart, I can jump like David jump. When the Spirit of the Lord is in my heart, I can jump like David jump. 
I can jump, oh Lord, I can jump, oh Lord, I can jump, I can jump, I can jump, oh Lord, I can jump, oh Lord, I can jump, I can jump, and fight when the spirit of the Lord is in my heart. I can find the game in four. When the Spirit of the Lord is in my heart, I can find the game in four. I can find, oh Lord, I can find, oh Lord, I can find the game in four. I can find, oh Lord, I can find, oh Lord, I can find the game in four. One! When the Spirit of the Lord is in my heart, I can win a game in war. When the Spirit of the Lord is in my heart, I can win a game in war. I can win, oh Lord, I can win, oh Lord, I can win a game in war. I can win, oh Lord, I can win, oh Lord, I can win a game in Sing unto the Lord that do so. Sing unto the Lord of the earth. Sing unto the Lord that do so. Sing unto the Lord. Sing unto the Lord. Sing unto the Lord that do so. Sing unto the Lord of the earth. Sing unto the Lord that do so. Sing unto the Lord of the earth. Amen. For God is great, great and to be praised. God is great, great and to be praised. Say unto the Lord, a new song. Say unto the Lord of the earth. Say unto the Lord, a new song. Say unto the Lord of the earth. For God is great, great and to be praised. God is great, great and to be praised. To the Lord a new song. Say unto the Lord of the earth. Say unto the Lord a new song. Say unto the Lord of the earth. One more time, God is great. God is great, great and to be praised. God is great, great and to be praised. Sing unto the Lord a new song. Sing unto the Lord of the earth. Sing unto the Lord a new song. Sing unto the Lord of the earth. Sing unto the Lord of the earth. Sing unto the Lord of the earth. Amen. Amen. Prepare to receive the Lord. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Lord. Amen. Tunay nga, napakasarap magpuri sa ating Panginoon. Amen. Di ba yung ating katawan kanina na matamlay, ngayon ay malakas na. Amen. Hallelujah. Sapagkat nirestore po ng ating Panginoon ang ating kalakasan. Amen. Sa pagkakataong ito, damin po natin ang presensya ng ating Panginoon. Ating isa puso, ang lahat ng lyrics na ating marinig sa mga oras na ito sapagkat ang awiting ito ay talagang tunay nga na, nakapagpagaan sa ating mga damdamin Amen. sapagkat nagkaroon po tayo ng pag-asa sa ating Panginoong Jesus Hallelujah Yes, Hallelujah Lord So Lord, come with us, O oh God. Hallelujah, Purin God Jesus. We see you, Lord God. I see the Lord. I see the Lord exalted high upon the worship of the people of the earth. I 
worship you when the spirit is true there will never be a friend as dear to me as you heaven lord joy of my desire
Panginoon. Puri ka, Jesus. Hallelujah. Magari ka, Panginoon. Magari ka sa buhay po namin. Hallelujah, Lord. Hallelujah, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for your the blessing, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord, the privilege, the privilege, Lord Jesus, to worship you, to praise you, Jesus. Today, nga, Panginoon, you deserve the highest praises, God. You deserve, Lord Jesus, ang ating, aming mga worship, Panginoon, sa iyo. Salamat, Lord. Dadama po namin ang iyong presensya, Lord God, sa aming kalagitan, Panginoon. Salamat sa Panginoon sa pagtanggap mo sa aming pagpupuri, Lord Jesus. Tunay nga, Panginoon, ang aming pagpupuri ay para lamang sa iyo, Lord. Para lamang sa iyo, Lord Jesus. Amin kang itaas, Panginoon. Amin kang damhin ang iyong presensya. I-glorify ka namin, Panginoon. Maraming maraming salamat, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Pray natin natin, Panginoon. Pray natin natin, Panginoon. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Napakabuti po ng Panginoon. Amen. Praise God. Na naramdaman po natin talaga yung presensya ng Panginoon. Amen. You know, mga magwalang at kapatid, it is okay to cry. It is okay to cry to the Lord. It is, it is okay to let it out to the Lord. Kung ano man po yung mga pinagdadaanan natin, kung ano man po yung mga bigatin natin, let it out. Give it to the Lord. At nandito po ang presensya ng Panginoon. Hindi niya po tayo iiwan hindi niya tayo pababayaan. Amen. Praise God. So, okay lang po na umiyak ka na parang bata sa harapan ng Panginoon. Gusto po ng Panginoon na siya lamang po yung ating sandigan, siya lamang po yung ating nilalapitan. Amen po ba? Amen. Kaya purihin po ang Panginoon dahil tunay po na ang kanyang dakilang presensya ay nasa ating kalagitnaan. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Praise the Lord. So, may mga additional live streamers po tayo from Bahrain. We have Sister Rochelle Losaldo, amen, from Bahrain na naka-live stream. And ganun din po, Sister Charlotte, nasa Pilipinas po sila, amen. So, naka-live stream din po sila Brother Gary and Sister Charlotte. Welcome po, amen, praise God. So, sa pagkakataon naman po na ito, ito naman po ang pagkakataon natin na makapagbigay naman po tayo ng pagpupuri sa pamamagitan ng paghahandog sa ating Panginoon, amen. Kaya tinatawagan ko na po ang ating kapatid na Sister Chanda upang magbigay po ng paalala patungkol po sa pagbigay. Tayo. Buksan po natin ang ating mga banal na aklat sa Philippians chapter 4 verse 19. Philippians chapter 4 verse 19 Ando na po ba ang bawat isa? Babasahin ko po sa English But my God shall supply all your need according to His riches in glory by Jesus Christ Sa Tagalog po At pupuna ng aking Diyos ang bawat kailangan ninyo ayon sa kanyang mga kayamanan sa kaluwalhatian kay Heso Kristo. Amen. Magsiupo muna po tayo. Indeed, God is our great provider. Amen. The Lord God is not slack concerning His promise. So we need, so we must be thankful and blessed for what God has promised to us that He will supply all our needs. Kaya kahit anong problema meron tayo, kailangan pa din po nating magpasalamat at purihin ang ating nag-iisang Diyos na buhay. Not all the time we have to ask and ask from Him. We too have to do our part to give our tithes and offering with a cheerful heart. We have to obey His words, follow His commands, and walk for righteousness. Because God is not blind and deaf 
for what prayers we are asking for Him. That's why God promised to us to supply all our needs according to His riches and glory. Amen. Magsitayo po tayo upang manalangin. Hallelujah, Lord. Hallelujah, Lord God Jesus. Panginoon, muli po maraming maraming sa salamat po sa privilege na ipinagkaloob mo po sa upang magbigay ng paalala po patungkol sa pagbibigay, Lord God Jesus. Lord God, convict po, nawa po makonvict mo po ang bawat isa sa pagbibigay, Lord, na mayroong pusong nagagalak po, Lord God Jesus, hindi po yung napipilitan lamang, Lord. Lord God, ang sama, sa mga kapatid ko po na magbibigay, Lord, bless and guide them always, Lord God Jesus. Nawa, Lord, ikaw lang ang aming uh, itataas sa araw ng aming mga buhay, Lord God Jesus. Nawa po, Lord, ibalik mo po ng siksik, liglig, at umaapaw na pagpapala. Lord God Jesus, ikaw ang maghari sa bawat isa po sa amin. Ikaw lang po ang aming pupurihin, sasambahin, at dadakilain sa iyong matamis na pangalan. Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we pray. Amen. Amen. God bless po sa bawat isa. Amen. So sa pagkakataon naman po na ito, magbibigay po ng handog na awit ang ating kapatid, nakababatang kapatid mula sa Children's Ministry. Amen. Tinatawag ako na po si Brother Waki Rianta. So palakpakan po natin ang ating Panginoon.
future praise and worship team leader. Amen. Praise God. So sa pagkakataon po nito, this is the moment na pinakakaantay po natin ang bawat isa. Amen. But before I give it to the messenger, gusto ko lang tanong, sino dito hindi marunong umiyak? Wala, no? Normal po siguro na lahat tayo marunong tayong umiyak. Kahit na nung paglabas pa lang natin sa sinapapunan ng ating ina, tayo ay mayroon ng iyak, di po ba? Parang hindi normal kapag ang sanggol ay hindi umiiyak. I'm sure God has a wonderful message this morning. Amen. This is the righteous cry. Amen. So I will give it now to the messenger of the Lord. May I call in Pastor Christopher Aguilar. Isang malakas na palakpak po sa ating nag-iisang Diyos. Praise God. God is good. And all the time. Amen. It's an honor and privilege again to preach the gospel of God. So we have uh, Brother Raj and uh, Brother Robert. So 80% will be in Tagalog. Is it fine? Sis Sister Wang is uh, beside you. And, uh, Brother Raj, uh, Brother Dennis is, uh, is there with you. You're back. Okay. Amen. God is good. And all the time. Just a few minutes back, I received a call and a call. So I might leave early because we have emergency now. So uh, I hope they will not call me again. But I know God has a uh, plan because uh, medyo uh, critical po yung injured. We request the congregation to please stand and let's open our Bible in the book of Psalms. Amen. The message for today, it will not take long. I know you are... Uh, you want to go or you want to leave early. Amen. So if your heart, you went here because you want to worship, Kaliwali. You can stay until 2 o'clock, right? Amen. Amen. Once a week na nga lang tayo nakikita dito, eh, right? Amen. Lubos lubusan na po natin. God is good. And all the time. Amen. Let's open our Bible in the book of Psalms. Chapter number 34, verse 17. Amen. This is a powerful verse. And I want you to, uh, to uh, put a mark, put asterisk, ano po, because this is a verse that sometimes will help us during the time of distress. 
it will help us you know, po, para ma-release natin yung ating pong mga emotions. Amen. And my wife is right. As a doctor, our basis for uh, a healthy baby born is kasama po yun, we, we call the APGAR score. A-P-G-A-R. Part of the APGAR score is that the moment that the baby will come out from the womb, amen, we have to assess the baby. When the baby is not crying, we spank them, we stimulate them to cry. Right? Ang ating mga nurses, they know it. Amen. They know it. If the cry is weak, there's a problem. But when the cry is strong, good boy or good girl, amen. You're doing right. You're doing great. But if the patient is not crying, eh, eh, there's something wrong. So we need to stimulate the patient. You know why? Because all the mucus nandun sa lungs. So we need to, to, uh, to uh, lalo na yung mga cesarean. Sino mga cesarean dito? Candidate cesarean. You know, mga cesarean, you know, the lungs of your baby, they did not, you know, um, went out in the proper channel. That's why we, they were not squeezed. Amen. So, pag nagle-labor, yung mga normal delivery, this is just, ba tayo napunta dyan? Normal delivery, once they were squeezed, uh, then, parang, ah! Right? Because they, they had some pain. The labor pain, not only related to the father, or to the father, to the mother, excuse me, excuse me. <laughs> but, it is also the pain suffered by a baby born Amen. 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 So my wife says, right. All of us, we went in the process. We cry. We cry. And it's a good sign. It's a healthy sign. Amen. Once a newborn cry out very loud, this is a sign that is healthy. So sino dito hindi pa umiyak sa kanilang mga buhay? How many of you did not experience cry? Amen. Maybe at the end of the service, you will cry. Amen. The Bible says, oops, what happened? Okay. Thank you. Psalms 34, 17. The righteous cry, and the Lord hear it. Meron palang righteous cry. Not all cry, we're righteous. Last Sunday, if you attended the service, and the was a Sunday worship service natin, the cry of the sinners is abomination to God. So, if there is abomination like the cry of the sinners, now babawi tayo, may righteous cry. Amen. And the Lord hear it. And this is the good news. And He delivered them out of their troubles. Amen. Sino my troubles right now? Come on, church. Sino may mga troubles? Let's worship the Lord. Come on, let's worship the Lord. Jesus, we worship you, Lord God. We glorify your name, O Lord God. Jesus, let's give him a hand clap of praise. In Jesus' name. 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 Heavenly Father, Lord God, Jesus, it is another day of worship, another day to give you praise and honor, O Lord God. And it's a privilege, O Lord God, to worship you in spirit and in truth. Father God, Lord Jesus, anoint us. Ikaw, Panginoon, Lord, ang mangunat maghari sa amin. We do believe, Father God, that you brought us here because you have, you have a purpose. At the end of the service, O Lord God, Jesus, we will understand fully why there are certain things like the righteous cry. Teach us, O Lord God, to humble ourselves. Teach us, O Lord God, Jesus, to know you more and to understand, O Lord God, the beauty of your holiness. We worship you in spirit and in truth, O Lord God. Let your sons and daughters, Lord, be receptive of your word. We do believe, Lord God Jesus, that you will not allow us to leave this place, O Lord God Jesus, na wala pong nagbabago sa aming mga buhay because we declare that you are our master. You are the King of kings. You are the Lord of lords. And we worship you, Lord God Jesus, with your mighty angels in our midst. In Jesus' name, in Jesus' name, amen. Amen, amen. You may be seated. You may be seated. Amen. Life is a time frame. Amen. Do you believe that, church? Life is a time frame. 
There's a specific date, a specific hours, a specific day, a specific minutes, a specific seconds that you will be born in this earth. Amen. There's a time frame because Jesus is the author and finisher of our faith. The reason why God brought you here because He has a wonderful plan sa ating mga buhay. Amen. You did not just pop out in this word just like that. Amen. So remember, you have a date of production and you have a date of expiration. All of us, we will die here. Maybe one of us. All of us will die. So we are living in a time frame where in fact that God is watching over us. Amen. And until now, some people, they haven't seen the wonders and miracles of God. You were invited here maybe for the first time. Maybe you don't know about Jesus. Or maybe you know about God, but you don't even worship Him like we worship as we do for the past few months here in Asraqs. So we're living in a time frame that one day, during those time frame, troubles will come. Troubles will come along the way. And if you don't know your master, if you don't know the King of Kings and Lord of Lords, if you don't know your great physician, if you don't know the Rose of Sharon, if you don't know Jesus in your heart, then you might, you might end up shortening that time frame. But God gave us a wonderful plan. Amen. And thank God, sabi mo sa mo, thank God I'm alive. You have to be thankful, church of God. Irregardless of what situation you have, you are still existing in that time frame. Amen. It doesn't matter. This is trouble. This is happiness. Masaya ka, malungkot. It's time to worship God. And there's no escape. Because ang obligation ng tao, the obligation of every individual is to worship God. And last week, ano ginawa natin last week? We just take a deep breath, right? Deep breath. Thank God you still have breath. That means you have life. That means you have hope. That means you're not, you're not done yet. That means your time frame is not done yet. But sometimes people, they just ignore. And they just give up. They surrender everything. God is not finished yet. Tinutuldukan mo ng plan ng Panginoon. Amen. And some people, they cry. Trouble might come. Problema man yan. Relationship problem. Financial problem. Amen. It's normal to cry. Right? Sabi nga, I'm always telling this. During the childbirth, pag umiyak ang bata, everybody is happy. Right? And this little cute baby, newborn, crying. And everyone is laughing. Everybody is rejoicing. Because a newborn in this earth. Amen. Ah, ako yung ninong, ako yung ninang. I'm the godfather, I'm the godmother. And po, napaka cute kamukha ni Tito. Hindi, kamukha ni mommy. Hindi, kumika ni pare. Ay, ah, kamukha ni... <laughs> Diba? So, everybody is happy, but the baby, newborn, is crying. Right? That is the time frame in your first day of life. That's the first day of life that God gave you. Crying. Umiyak. It's not normal. If a baby born will not cry, that's abnormal. Sabihin mo nga sa tabi mo, abnormal ka ba? Abnormal ka. <laughs> That's the time frame. Now, what's this? At the end of your time frame, if God will take you away in this earth, in this earth, all of the people surround you, they are all crying. And here you are, you are rejoicing. See, nakikita natin yung life. You are rejoicing because you will meet the master. And maybe you will cry if you will go to hell. That's another problem. <laughs> right? Pero, thank God. God is giving us a chance right now to know Him more, to love Him more. 
Amen. Because there's no other time. The time is limited, brothers and sisters. The time is at hand. Jesus Christ is coming very, very soon. The time is at hand. Amen. And you should know why you are leaving this earth. Hindi ka po nandito sa Bahrain just to work, sleep, work. Pag Friday, maglalaba. This is not an excuse. You have to worship God. You have to worship God. Now, yeah, ngayon, I just received a report. Emergency meeting. 12 o'clock. Dadalo ang isip ako. Ang unahin ko. I'm working with God. Employed ako ng Panginoon. So I don't want to miss the most powerful and the most important meeting right now. Amen. Amen. It's a matter of giving priorities. So, Church of God sometimes cry is one of the best tools that when the righteous cry, the Lord immediately hear your cries. If you are attending our Donwats, even our prayer warrior every Monday, amen, narinig mo yan, maraming umiyak. They are all crying sometimes. Ano po, hindi lang iyak, puro makasipon and everything. Amen. Because they know that the righteous cry, God heareth. Heareth. And because of the righteous cry, it delivered them out of all their troubles. Are you in trouble? Oh, no, church. Sino po nasa trouble ngayon? I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Every day, we're facing a lot of troubles. And God is allowing it. God is allowing the trouble, brothers and sisters. Amen. You know, Satan cannot just do some mess sa buhay mo. Do you agree on that? Again, let's go back in, in the book of Job. I love now, you know, because I'm reading the book of Job for the past few weeks. Amen. Job, brothers and sisters, in Job chapter 1, verse 6, amen, God is allowing Satan. Inaalaw lang niya si Satan para magmess sa buhay po ni Job. But Satan, he has no, no, uh, no, no uh, what do you call it? As he has no power. Amen. Because God will allow it. Amen. So if God will allow it, that means God, your God, knows your capabilities. If God is allowing temptations in your life, that God trusts you enough that you can win the battle. Right? Now, if you fail God, then that's another story. That means you fail God. Amen. God will never give you a test or trials na hindi po alam ng Panginoon that you can do it. Of course, He can do it. Amen. He can fight for you. But the problem is, brothers and sisters, sometimes we're giving up. Come on. Binigyan ka ng problema ng Panginoon. The reason why I gave you this problem because He knows that you can bear it. Kayang-kaya mo yan. But to surrender ka, that means you don't trust God. Amen. Amen po ba? So the righteous cry, and the Lord hear it, and deliver them out of all their troubles. The Lord is nigh unto them. Sino mga broken-hearted dito? Magsabing amen. Mga broken-hearted. Wala tayong mga broken-hearted. Come on. Sister Karen, broken-hearted ka? Broken-hearted. Fracture ang heart. Fracture. Okay lang ang fracture, no? Wag lang yung brain yung ma-fracture. Ano yung nakakita? Have you seen a brain that is fractured? Broken heart. The Lord is nigh unto them that are of broken heart and save it such as be of a contrite spirit. Amen. Let's talk again. Okay. Verse 19. Many are the afflictions of the righteous. See? The righteous cry. And then now, many are, they have afflictions. The righteous, they have afflictions. Amen. Sasabihin mo, ah, I will attend a Bible or I will attend this group, yung mga born, born again. Sabi kasi nila, pag may born again ka na, wala ka ng problema. Do you agree on that? Do you agree on that? If you will attend or you, if you will, you, if you will allow yourselves to mingle with among Bible believing Christians, sometimes they are telling you, this is a false hope. Ah, pag na born again ka, wala ka ng problema. Come on, church. That's a false hope. Amen. That's a false hope. Amen. The moment that you are in God's hand, the more Satan will do a lot of things to mess you up. Amen. God will not allow. Sometimes God is covering you up. But sometimes if God will say, oh, ah, I can trust this son or my daughter. I can trust LB. Sige, Satan, allow. You can, you can do whatever you want. But, 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 wag mong gagalawin kanyang buhay. Amen. Sometimes he's allowing us like that. Right? At the end of the day, it's up to you. 
You have to be confident enough. Lord, you gave me this problem because I know and you know that I can do it. But I cannot do it alone, Lord. So I can do all things through Christ. Who strengthened me? I can do all things through Christ who strengthened me. Amen. And watch this. God will show you the way. Amen. The moment that you will show God that you are not surrendering. Nandun ka Fight, 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 fight. God will bless you more, more and more, more and more. Amen. Mamamangha ang Diyos sa'yo. Wow! Ang daming problema nito, nakangiti pa. Diba? Right? Wow! Pag mamalaki ka na, like what happened to Job? Pinagmalaki ng Panginoon. Have you seen my son Job? Lucifer? Yeah, because you are giving him blessings. That's why he loves you. Try to give him some, some problems. Take all what he have, even his family. He will surrender. Okay, I give you the go signal. Do it. Amen. Job, he was about to give up. But by the grace of God, he won the battle. He won the battle. Amen. Amen. Kaya nga po, kayang-kaya mo. Sabihin mo nga sa tabi mo, kayang-kaya mo. Kasama ang Panginoon, siyempre. Right? So, many are the afflictions, many are afflictions of the righteous, but the Lord delivered him out of them all. Ah, all, 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 all. Imagine, He will deliver you out all ng mga troubles mo. You have trouble in your asawa, trouble in your financial, trouble sa trabaho, trouble mo sa, sa kapwa mo, may trouble ka sa kilikili, may trouble ka sa... Bunganga mo, lahat yan, all. That's how God works. That's how God works, brothers and sisters. Amen. He will deliver you out of all the troubles that you have. Amen. And the question is, what are the afflictions? Let's just find out, what is affliction, sister? Grace. It is a state of pain, distress or grief, or misery. And mga afflictions. Afflictions. How many of us suffered this state of pain? May pain ka. May arthritis ka na ngayon. Dati wala. <laughs> Nakaka- nakaka-relate kayo ah. Distressed. You lost your job. You lost somebody. You love. A grip. Misery. A cause of mental or bodily pain. Sickness. Amen. I hope Sister Lalas is watching right now. This message is for you, Sister Loss, calamity, or persecution. Amen. So, if you are righteous, you are not excused to have afflictions. Can I repeat that? Ah, hindi ito yung pastor ko. Because my pastor said, blessing, 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 magbigay ka sa ikapu. God will bless you ten times. For all. No. I'm sorry, this church doesn't believe that if you will give, amen, ganito, ten times. No. Part yan ng worship, mga kapatid. Church is not a business. Kapag magbigay ka, you are expecting that God will bless you. No, blessing is not about financial matters. Amen. It's not about financial matters. If you think, ganun po, nagbibigay ka because you want to have more blessings, then you are in the, mis- in the, in the wrong place. Ha? Mag-invest ka na lang sa stock market. If this is what you think, Amen. But I, what I'm telling you right now, righteous people, you are not excused to have some afflictions. Amen. And the good news, if you will cry, the righteous cry, God will always hear it. The cry of the righteous. Amen. Ano man mga afflictions yan, whatever problems you may face, any problems, mga sicknesses, cancer, amen, mga, 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 mga more Big na sakit, brothers and sisters, I'm telling you, the cry of the righteous, God, hear it, them. Amen. He keep it all his bones. Not one of them is broken. Right? Kaya sa kanina, pati yung heart natin, no? Hindi broken niya. Kahit... God will always protect you. Amen. Bungo. Last three weeks, three weeks ba yun, brother Larry? Three weeks ago. You know, we had a major, major, major accident. Imagine, na sandwich kami. Me and Brother Larry, ano po, we were crushed in between four cars. 
Ah, Sister Marilyn, sorry ah, yung sakin nyo, talaga, totally mass. Destroyed! San si Brother Jay? Ano nang update natin doon? Ano na ba? In pound na, in pound? Okay, so kinocompute pa, no? Kinocompute pa ang damage. But I think, uh, hindi na po siya pwede magamit. After the incident, after the accident, binuksan namin mga pintuan. Bro, okay ka lang? Pastor, okay lang ako. Ikaw, Pastor. I'm okay. Everybody's clear. See, because I'm a primary responder. Amen. When I saw all the drivers, they said, okay, okay. So we called the ambulance and one of them dinala sa Salmania. Because God, if you will cry, righteous people, saints of God, He will keep all your bones. Not one of them is broken. None of them is broken. Do you believe that, church? I believe that because I believe that God is doing great. Matthew 5, 6. Blessed, blessed are they which do hunger and thirst after righteousness. Amen. Do you like righteousness of God? Gusto mo ba yung righteousness ng Diyos? That you want to live righteous? Right? Everybody wants to live righteous. Because righteousness, amen, kakambal niyan is peace. If you are living right, if you are talking right, if you are walking right, nothing, amen, shall separate you from the love of God. If you love God more than anything else, brothers and sisters, God will always keep you, amen, and He will protect and guide you whatever troubles may come. Blessed are they which do hunger and thirst after righteousness, for they shall be filled. Amen. You want righteousness. Dati crooked ang buhay mo. Wickedness ang buhay mo. But when you found Jesus, what He did in the cross of Calvary, now you started to have this hunger and thirst. No, I don't want to live this kind of life anymore. Ayoko na. Ayoko na magkaroon ng boyfriend. Ayoko na si Muhammad, si Isa, si Ahmed. Yeah, sir. I don't want. Gusto ko lang si Jesus. Looking unto Jesus, the author and finisher of our faith. Amen. Ang ganda ng AMA slogan, ano? AMA. Sucks, ano? Access to success. Ah, huwag ka mag-asawa ng ibang mga, ibang mga, ibang mga, mga, mga reliyon, brothers and sisters, para makalong ka lang ng access. Gusto mo magkaroon ng barin passport, manatili ka dito hanggang 80 years old. Bibigyan ka, mahawa sila. Bibigyan ka ng barin passport if you want. Amen. But it's not an access to success. The access is Jesus. Amen. Amen. The access is Jesus. Oops. What happened? Bakit nag-jump? Pinamadali mo yata ako, Sister Grace. Eh. Walang ganyanan. Okay, what happened? Okay. What happened? Okay lang po. Righteousness. What do you mean by righteousness? Just to give you some important thing. It's about goodness. It's about virtue, virtuousness, uprightness, decency, integrity, worthiness, rectitude, morality, high-mindedness, justice, honesty, honor, honorableness, innocence, blamelessness, guiltlessness, sinlessness, purity, nobility, noble-mindedness. Sino po ang mayroong mga ganitong quality? Say amen. Oh my God. You failed. Wala po dito 75%. God needs A+. Plus. Sino po dito ang may righteousness? Goodness, virtue, virtuousness, uprightness, decency, integrity, worthiness, rectitude, morality, high-mindedness, justice, honesty, honor, nobleness, innocence, blamelessness, guiltlessness, sinlessness, purity, nobility, noble-mindedness. Sino po dito ang mayroong ganyan? Come on, church. Amen! Why are you scared? Oh? Wala na, uwi na tayo. Let's just go home. Eh, wala palang mangyayari kahit iyak na iyak ka na dyan. Walang mangyayari siya because the righteous cry. God hear it. If, if you are not righteous, God will never hear you. How many of you right now feel that you are righteous in sight of God? Magsabing amen. amen. Lakas nyo. Mag... Ayaw ng Panginoon ng double-minded. Come on, church. Ang hirap pa na. But I'm telling you, being righteous... Dapat sinlessness. Blamelessness. Honest. You're living in morality. 
So if you don't have those qualifications, do you think that you are righteous? If you don't have those qualities in your life, don't expect that God will hear your cry. Sometimes we're just blaming God. Lord, hindi mo na ako pinapakinggan. Why? Pinapakinggan mo ba ako, anak? No, I just reminded you, I warn you, your life is crooked, your life is wicked. Did you hear my voice? Lord, you have grace, right? Yes, God is full of grace. God is merciful, brothers and sisters. But quit doing some excuses. Amen. God is not happy to see you living in sin. Hindi po natutuwa ang Diyos, brothers and sisters, if you are still living in sin right now. Okay. You can attend prayer warrior thousand times, million times if your life is not righteous in the sight of God. Yung prayer mo hanggang ding-ding lang. And that's how, why we, li- we are living powerless. Amen. Wala tayo, wala, wala, hindi, we cannot even feel the presence of God. The problem is it's not God. In the book of Isaiah, we mentioned earlier that the hand of God is not shortened. The hear of, the of God is not that. The reason why God cannot even take you and hear your voice because there's a huge gap between you and God and that's sin. If you're not living righteous, brothers and sisters, don't expect God to hear you because you'll never hear the word of God. Misan, di ba, nagtatampo tayo, Lord, hindi mo ako pinapakinggan eh. Magtatampo ka, hindi ka pa nga mag-aatin ng church eh. Pag mamalakihan mo ang Diyos, you cannot. You cannot. Search your heart. Baka ikaw ang may problema. Of course, you have the problem, not God. Kahit anong gawin mo, God is still God. Kahit anong gawin mo, God is still God. God will never change. But the reason why we failed, because of unrighteousness. Right? Because of unrighteousness. Yes, I know God's word is very painful, it's very powerful. Masagit na salita ng Panginoon, but wake up, church. Sometimes we don't have have, the, have the, 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 the ability and the to move on sa time frame na binigay ng life ng Panginoon sa inyo, then it's only around maybe 20% of your lifespan, you will be killed. You will be troubled. Amen? Mamaya, baka pag nandiyan ka, nandiyan sa elevator, madaganan ka ng kutsyon. You need to appreciate God's faithfulness, Church of God. Huwag tayo panay, puro blaming game. Panay natin, parang, parang, Sinisisi natin ang Panginoon every now and then. No, it's not. It's not. Amen. What's this? Matthew 6.33. Seek ye first God's kingdom. Seek ye first God's kingdom. Ah, I found the church. Yes, I found the church. Praise the Lord. May kasama po yan. In His righteousness. Going to the church will not, will not you make you saints. Pagpunta mo sa church, hindi ka magiging banal. Living. Inside of you, in the church, will make you saint. Amen. Right? A lot of people, they miss this. They are attending church. Lagi sila nag ng every Sunday. Nandun sila. Ah, present ako. Nandun ako. Okay. And then go back sa old nature. They forgot to preach. Seek ye first God's kingdom of God. And it's righteousness. Righteousness. Why? Kasi kung hindi po tayo righteous, God will never hear our prayers. Come on, church, wake up. Ginising ko ba kayo? Ha? O natutulog pa rin? Sister Lerby, dahil pa lang nag-uusap, gusto ka na kapatid? Okay ka lang? Bakit? Parang, ha? Ah, yes, this is the word of God. It's quick and powerful, masagin na salita ng Panginoon. But if your prayers, if your word prayers want to be, to be, uh, to be heard by God, we have to check ourselves right now. You have to search your heart. Amen. Baka po hindi tayo matuwid sa harapan ng Panginoon. Yes, nahanapan mo ng church. Yes, I found a church. Nandyan sa Aslam, nandyan sa Mohara. But if you are not living righteousness, brothers and sisters, don't expect God will hear you. Because if you are righteous, Amen. Ang hirap naman, Pastor Chris, maging righteous. Yes, it's hard. Mahirap po. I'm not righteous. I'm not perfect. I'm just a human being. But come on, church. Kung mag... Mag, 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 hindi po tayo mag-preach dito about righteousness. Magja-jackin po yun na lang tayo, Sister Nelia. Ha? Ano tumama sa loto ngayon? Ha? Yan na lang pag-usapan natin sa church. Now, this is the problem all over the world. 
ang church niya pinag-uusapan. O ano na si Duterte? So, ano pa na? Ah, ah. Amen. Amen po ba? Ba't kayo malungkot? Sometimes ang mga news ng Panginoon, nakakalungkot, ano? Ha? Amen. Whew. Are you ready, church? Can I, can, I, can I just repeat that? Sometimes, some news from God is horrible. Pag ang news from God, sometimes is horrible. Amen. Can we apply what we have learned a few minutes back? Brother Nilo? 2 Kings 20. This is very well known in this church. Let's just apply the righteous cry. In those days, sabi ng Bible, was Ezekiah sick unto death. Ezekiah is a king. Ezekiah lived a righteous life. Ezekiah, even if he's a king, is not exempted to have some diseases. Even you are a man of God, you are not excused to have some diseases. If you are workers of God, you're not an excuse na hindi ka magkaroon ng trouble. Trouble is everywhere. Trouble is everywhere. Di ba last week, I just have my personal testimony, right? Sabi ko, lost time of, last time injury, no? We were able to, to uh, we reached already 4 million and 600 hours. We have only 400 hours. And then that means we, we already succeeded 5 million without lost time injury. Wow! Another breakthrough ng Alba. Last Tuesday, nagkaroon ng small pastoral appreciation last Tuesday in the church. So I was blessed, really. All the members, they gave their you know, po, yung kanilang mga appreciation sa inyong lingkod, and I was really blessed. Before 10 o'clock, I received a call. There was a blast injury inside the plant. A hot metal. Ano po, hot metal. Imagine, kumukulo. It's around 1,200 degrees centigrade. A new metal, it was not melted. When they pour out the metal, this metal, solid metal, went down and it became, you know, like flash. Splash, sorry, splash. One of our superintendent sustained third degree burn. Sunog ang kanyang dalawang paa. And the other one sustained multiple first and second degree. And it happens right after pastoral appreciation. 10 o'clock, they called me. 11.30, they called me. 2 o'clock, kalas. Past, uh, doctor, the patient was admitted in Salmania. For how long? For one week. So that's lo- lost time injury. So all the managers, the following day, we, we had an executive meeting. And then sabi nila, Dr. Chris, a lot of rumors are going right now outside Alba. They said, you know, critical, critical, critical. You have now to stand. What is your categorization? Sabi ko, this is lost time injury. All their heart melted. What to do? I cannot just pull out yung patient. Okay, do ko na lang sa bahay. Do na lang I cannot. See, Satan can, can, you know, can mess you up. But I know that God gave me this this, this wisdom on how to win this battle. And just right now, before coming in this, in this church, they called me. One contractor is masked yung left leg, both tibia and fibula. You saw, no? Yung pictures. Though, this is another LTI, lost time injury. See? In a second, in a minute, life can turn upside down. During the time frame that God gave you, a lot of troubles will come your way. A lot of troubles will come your way. But at the end of the day, you have to praise God. You have to thank God. Because God says, I will never leave you nor forsake you. Because God is awesome. Amen. God will never leave us nor forsake us. Amen. And now they said, Dr. Chris, we need you at 12 o'clock. So 11.30. Sasakin na ako ng plan na para makapunta sa Alba. Ezekiah is a king. Though he is a king, he's not exempted to have sicknesses, afflictions. Amen. Hanisha. Amen. 
Those days, Ezekiah sick unto death. And this is not an ordinary sickness, brothers and sisters. This is maybe cancer. Bible scholars, they said it's like a big boil in the abdomen, big lump. So we don't know, maybe this is sarcoma. Stage 4, carcinoma, we don't know. But the Bible says he had a sickness na pwede niya kamatay. And the prophet Isaiah, the son of Amos, came to him and said unto him, Thus saith the Lord. See, in this Amos, this is the news from God. Thus saith the Lord, set thine house in order, for thou shalt die and not live. Wow, how many of you received that horrible report? Uh, maybe Sister Elby can, you know, can, can, uh, can share yung kanya pong, uh, yung kanya agony. The moment that they read the report, ah, uh, Miss Elby, sorry, you have carcinoma in situ, you have colonic CA, blah, 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 you have rectal CA, blah, 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 stage 2, stage 3. Amen. How many of you received that report? Huh? Tomorrow, mamamatay ka na. Surely, you will not live. And this is the word of God. This is not the word of Amos or Isaiah. This is the word of God. Kaya sometimes the word of God is not, it's not fun. Right? Masakit ang salita ng Panginoon. Just right now, you cannot even say amen because I know God is talking to you right now. And it hurts. Deep hurts. Deep wounds. Amen. See, what happened to Ezekiah? When Isaiah told Ezekiah, Today, set thine house. Ayusin mo na yung pamamahay mo. Because surely, you will die. Surely, you will die. Amen. Sino po dito nakaranas ng mga near-death experience? How many of you experienced a near-death experience? Come on. I did. 2012, I had an atrial fibrillation. I was admitted in King Hamad. And King Hamad, nandiyan na kayo, no, mga kapatid? Wala pa kayo, 2012? Nandun ka na, Stereo Sale? I was admitted. Atrial fibrillation. I ignore, I ignore, because I'm a doctor, I know. When they brought me in, in King Hamad, Brother Robert, you know, my, my pulse is like shooting to 200, 260. <laughs> Para si Brother uh, Rick, Ricardo, no? <laughs> it's atrial fibrillation. And one of the junior doctors, he attended my case. Wala na siguro yun. Nasibakli siguro. I don't know. He did an ECG. Okay, 12 lead ECG. I can hear, you know, regular, irregular, regular, irregular. That sounds AF, right? The doctor said, Doctor, you have SBV. So we need to give you a dentist. Wait, 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 wait. Doctor, are you sure it's SBT? Yes, it's SBT. Can I see my ECG? When I saw, walang P waves. So that means my HL is fibrillating. Dapat lub dub, lub dub, lub dub, lub dub. For me, no. Yeah? Ang ganda. Ang ganda pag mas dan. So I told him, doctor, in due respect, please give me an ambulance. Dispatch me from VDF. So I called VDF and they're waiting for me. And it is AF. AF. And then a friend of mine is a cardiologist. Ha, ah, Dr. Chris, what happened? Uh, I have an AF. Oh, that's bad. Binigyan niya ako ng metroprolol. He gave me midazolam. He gave me a lot of medication. Amen. And while he's giving his medication, he's chatting with me. After two hours, my goodness, all those. The blood pressure ko po, maybe around 140 or 130 to one, shut down to 90 over 60. Nagpalpatory ako doon. And then I just hear them, you know, my wife, she was crying, my mom was there, they were crying, I know. I beg, Lord, if this is my time frame, plus, one high, let your will be done, Lord. Let your will be done. And that night, I saw the heaven's gate. Kaya po nakatayo ako ngayon because I know that all of us, uwi po tayo, may uwi yan tayo. And from that moment, that was around five years ago, I appreciate life. I appreciate life. Maybe my time frame was only like 40 or, or, or 36 years old, 37 years old during that time. Now, God extended me 
I'm already 41. Amen. And still God is giving me strength. And God is giving me life. Ano pa pong hihilingin ko? I already, I already, like, just, just a simple fraction. My time frame is kalas. But God is giving me hope. And I'm here, still, preaching the Word of God. Kahit naman ang nag-appreciate sa akin, kahit na nagagalit sa akin, I still preach the Word of God because I do believe the righteousness of crying of cry and righteous brothers and sisters, God hear the cry of the righteous. And Ezekiah, imagine he's a king. When they told him, Ezekiah, King Ezekiah, this is a, 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 a sad news from God, from God, not from other kings. This is from God. King Ezekiah, set thine order, your home in order for those shall die and not live. See, look at him, Ezekiah. Ezekiah, he can blame God. What? Come on, are you sure? Is that the voice of God? I'm sure. Are you sure? Mm, I mean, you're just joking, joking. I'm not joking. Isaiah, you stand firmly. I'm not joking. Set your dying house, you will be dead. When? William. What? You know, righteous people, they will not blame God. Whatever troubles na mangyari, they will just praise God. They will thank God for everything, right? This is a positive attitude. Mawalang ka ng trabaho, mawalang ka ng pera. You still have the gods to praise the Lord, right? Right? Nothing can separate you from the love of God. A broken hearted guy. I don't want to go to the church. I'm broken hearted. I don't want to go to church kasi wala akong transport. I don't want to go to the church kasi si Pastor Chris na naman na mag, mag, magpipreach. Sigurado ako na naman na patatamaan. Come on, stop making excuses. Ezekiah, when he heard the news, he turned his face to the wall. And what? And he prayed unto the Lord. How many of you can do that thing? Ah, my trouble na nga. This is a matter of life and death. Sinabi na siya, sinintan siya, anas siya. You will die. Ah, you will die. Ezekiah, now all the, uh, anong puneraria ang gusto mo? Huh? Anong gusto mong flower? What do you want? Puneraria. Anong gusto mong puneraria? See? Instead of blaming God, Ezekiah, he turned his face to the wall. Sometimes, church of God, if you are in trouble, face the wall. Face the wall. Huh? What can to me in the left? What can to me in the right? What can to me in the back? Face the wall. Face the wall. Face Jesus on the wall. Amen. You will not see anything but God. Right? Come on. Come on, church. At the end of the service, Anybody who will have this trouble, amen. Don't hear rumors. Huwag mo pakinggan yung mga yan ang sinasabi ko sa'yo eh. Nag-attend-attend ka pa kasi dyan eh. Huwag ka na mag-attend dyan. Diba? Right? Next week, huwag ka na mag-attend ha, Sister Donna. Ha? Huwag ka na mag-attend. Ano mapapala mo dyan? Wala kang mapapala dyan. Amen. Right, left, whatever. But Ezekiah, he went to the wall and he prayed. And he prayed. And he prayed. Watch this. I beseech thee, O Lord. Remember now how I have walked before thee in truth. Pinaalala niya ang Panginoon. Nirimay niya. Lord, I don't want to blame you. But remember, Lord, that I walk before thee in truth. Lumakad po ako sa iyo na righteous. Lumakad ako sa inyo, Lord, kahit wala akong pamasaya, inahanap ko ang iyong salita, gagawa ko ng kapamaraanan. I'm not relying kay Brother Larry. I'm not relying kay Brother uh, Archie. I'm not relying to anyone else. Kung wala akong perang pag-church, gagawa ko ng paraan. Kasi pagkailangan, pag-Gian, pag-anniversary, nakakapunta ako sa Gian. Eh. Nakakabili pa ako ng mga anniversary sale. Eh. Pagdating sa Diyos, napakakuripot mo. Ayaw mong magbigay ng 200 pills lang sa bus. Hello? Magkano na? 300 pills? No araw yun. I beseech thee, O Lord, remember now, I have walked before thee in truth and with what? With a perfect life? Huh? Huh? I have a perfect brain? I have a perfect body? I have a perfect strength? No! God is looking to your heart! 
Sabi niya, Lord, remember, parang ano, no? uh, parang nag-petition, no? Lord, remember, I walk in righteousness and in truth. And Lord, remember that I have a perfect heart and have done what is good in thy sight. And Ezekiah wept sore. Ano yung iyak? Ano mo yung wept sore? Umiyak ng may ibig? Oo, ganyan. Ganyan pa. Oo, sige pa. Oo. Yun. Sometimes, you know, pag nandun tayo in, 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 in distress, in terms, emotion, right? Have you ever experienced that? I experience that most of the time, brothers and sisters. Sometimes, I cannot even, I cannot even put some words in my heart you know, nandun lang ako, I will just cry. <laughs> it's, it's, it's too hard. Amen. He wept sore. He cried. The righteous cried. Church of God. Ezekiah was broken, but he was not defeated. Come on, church. God is telling you right now, you are broken, but you're not defeated yet. It's not the end of the war. It's not the end of the battle. Panalo ka pa rin. Please, come on, church. Ah, may problema kasi sponsor mo. Just, just keep calm. Keep calm. He did the right thing when he turned his face to the wall and prayed unto the Lord. That's the best thing. Amen. Pag may trouble, punta ka sa church. Mag-pray ka. Ah, if you're in trouble, just put your face in the wall. Amen. And pray. And pray. And pray. Pray. He also wept bitterly. Amen. Kaya nga every Friday, every, every Monday, even Don was, you can hear yung bitterness, yung, yung, yung bitter cry. Amen. Because they believe that the righteous cry, God hear it. Amen. Watch this. Are you excited, church? Yeah. Are you excited, church? Yeah. Okay. Sandalen, nag-move. Sa sobrang excited. Oh, bakit bumalik? See? Alam, alam ko, si Satan lang hindi excited eh. Right? Sister Grace? Right? Okay, watch this. Are you ready? Yeah. And it came to pass. 11.40 morning. Isaiah went to Ezekiah. 11.40 You will die! King Ezekiah, surely, 100%, the say the Lord. Pag sinabi ng Panginoon, hindi papalaya ang salita ng Panginoon. Right? Right? Come on, cheers. Right? Hindi papalaya ang salita ng Panginoon. You will surely die. 1040, uh, 1140. And he cried. 1041. Uh, 1141 to 1144. Hindi siya, he did not pray like, Lord, di ba may mga nagpe-pray ng ganyan? Closing prayer na nga lang, umabot pa ng 15 minutes eh. No? Dami pa sinasabi. Closing prayer, closing na nga. Lord, salamat po Lord sa binigay ng pagkain. Lord, ang sarap po Lord. Lalo-lalo na yung binigay nilang puto, Lord, kulay asul. May matamis ng konti, Lord, pero dahil may mga diabetics sa church, Lord, salamat Lord. At sa, sa damit po ng aking kapatid, Lord. Come on. Ezekiah, when he prayed, straight to the point. Lord, I walk in righteousness. I walk in truth. And my heart is perfect. Lord, here I am. Wala siya sinabi, Lord, heal me. Lord, do this, do that. No! He just reminded God that he walked with righteousness. And it came to pass. 11.40, Isaiah gave the horrible report. Isaiah was gone out into the middle court that the word of the Lord came to him. Palabas na siya. Palabas na siya yan. Ha? Umiiyak na. Iniwan mo, umiiyak. Di ba? Pag minsan, ganun ka. Mag, pag masalita ka, masakit. Di ba? Sakit mo magsalita. Di po ba? Hindi mo na in-expect yung emotion ng nararamdaman ng ibang tao. He was about to leave, Isaiah. And the word of God came. To him saying, turn again. Turn again, Isaiah. Yes, Lord. And tell Ezekiah, the captain of my people. Thus saith the Lord, the God of David, thy father. 
I have heard thy prayer. I have seen thy tears. Behold, I will heal thee. Woo! Wow. What's this? I, God, have heard thy prayer. If you are not righteous, God will never hear your prayer. I have seen thy. Nakita ng Panginoon ang luha mo? Huh? Huh? Imagine when God saw your tears, when God saw your life living righteous in the sight of God. Ano po ang sabi ng Panginoon? I will heal thee. How many minutes passed, Brother Nilo? Three minutes. God already judged. God already gave you a horrible report that you will die. But because you made the right thing, you made the right decision, you prayed, you faced the wall, and you reminded God that you are living in righteous life. Come on, church. I have heard your cry. I have seen your tears. I will heal you. On the third day, thou shalt go up into the house of the Lord. 10, 11, 45, everything has changed. Ngayon, ang problema mo, ang tagal na. Ang tagal ng problema mo. Alatul niya, may ages na, years na. But because you are not crying, or you're crying, but you are not living right, that's the problem. That's the problem. So if you want to live right, do it right now. If you want to transform your life, if God wants, if, if you want God to transform your life in within three minutes, bakit hindi po tayo manalangin sa Kanya? Bakit hindi natin puriin ang Panginoon? The most amazing response came from God barely minutes later when God said, I have heard your prayer and seen your tears. Indeed, I will heal you. That's why when I was admitted 2012, Dr. Asam Noor is one of the cardiologists of King Hamad. He came to my room. Said, yeah, Dr. Chris, everything's going great. We did your 2D echo. Your, your, your ejection fraction is around 65%. You don't have mitral discharge. You don't have aortic discharge. Everything's okay. Kahapon lang, AF. Kahapon lang, nag 50 ako. Okay, you can go. Umuwi ako before lunch. And then I invited my wife and my family. Kain tayo sa Ponderosa. Ponderosa was still there. Sabi ng doctor, low fat doctor. Yung diet mo. When I saw Ponderosa, everything changed. Sabi ko, blessing ng Panginoon. Nag-steak ako talaga. Steak ako. Di ba? Sama niyo naman ako eh. Minsan sa Tony Romas. <laughs> ano, Brother Aris? The most amazing part is that God can turn your life in a twinkling of an eye. God can transform your life. May problema ka? Na paulit-ulit? If you want to be transformed, gawin po natin yan. Gawin po natin yan. Amen. Friends, your tears can break the heart of God. <laughs> Ayaw ng Panginoon na humihiyak tayo. God doesn't want you know, to see you crying. It's like a father's heart. Pag nakikita ko, humihiyak mga anak ko, they're crying. Like, my heart is, you know, your tears means a lot sa ating Panginoon. And what's this? What's this? God healed him, right? And I will add unto thy days 15 years. Nag-add siya ng 15 years. 15 years, Nanay Aida. Wow! 15 years ang inad ng Panginoon kay Ezekiah. And not only that, I will deliver thee and this city out of the hand of King of Assyria. And I will defend this city. For my own sake and par, for my servants, they will say, Wow, imagine your simple cry, the simple righteous cry can change everything. Sabi ng Panginoon, hindi lang kita ng 15 years, lahat ng problema mo, solved na. City Bank, solved na. Standard Bank, solved na. SSBC Bank, solved na. 
Yes, Lord. Oh, oh. Sold na yan. Hindi naman ako nagbayad. I will pay in full. Paano, Lord? Problema ko na yan. Hindi mo na problema. Lord, tatakbuhan ko ba yung problema? Hindi mo tatakbuhan, anak. I will give you blessings. I will give you abundant blessing na ikaw mismo ay mamamangha. Talaga, Lord? Yes. God can transform everything. God can turn your life upside down. Church of God. Amen. This is the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. He is the God of Ezekiah. He is the God of Great Commission Ministries. And He will never change. He will never change. He will never change. Church of God. God changed His mind when He saw the tears of Ezekiah. God can change His mind for you too. If you will only believe and cry out in your heart and ask for help. Come on, church. Let's worship the Lord. Come on, church. Let's worship the Lord. Jesus. 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 Come on, church. Let's give Him praise. Let's give Him honor. Come on, church. Let's give Him praise. Come on, church. Let's worship the Lord one more time. Come on, church. Woo! Come on, Lord God, Jesus. You will never change, oh Lord God, Jesus. Napakabuti mo, Panginoon. Napakabuti mo, Panginoon. Imagine, brothers and sisters, if you have facing a lot of trials and tribulation and troubles right now, amen, it will not take 24 hours a day or 24 hours or 48 hours or 72 hours. If you have this problem, brothers and sisters, face the wall. Sabi mo sa Panginoon, Lord, I live a perfect heart, Lord God. So, yung time pray mo na dapat hanggang dito na lang, God is extended, extended it, extended it, extended it. Amen. And that's amazing. Amazing. Gusto po, sino bang gusto dito mamatay na? Magtas ng kamay. How many of you would like to, to go? I mean, maganda po experience. Pinaglalamayan. Makikita mo kung sino talagang totoo sa'yo. Gusto yung matry? Kaya ngayon, habang buhay pa, Sister Bendos, bigyan mo na ng bulaklak. Ano yan? Bulaklak ng patay. Bakit? O, oh, pag namatay ka, hindi mo naman makikita yan eh. Right? Di ba? And that's Sister Grace. Come on. It's... Sometimes we're giving the best kapag namatay na sila. Di ba, Nanay Beth? Bakit di pa natin bigay yung best ngayon? Why don't we call our loved ones sa Pilipinas? They missed you. Hindi, Pastor. Galit ako sa kanya kasi puro na lang penge, 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 penge. Well, God is blessing you. Share your blessings. Share your blessings. Lord, wala na lang natitira sa akin eh. Problema mo yun. And that how God's work Nawa po maging blessing ang word of God for you today. I know that it's not it's not it's not simple to live in righteous life. But gawin po natin. Nakalugod-lugod, wala tayong nasasaktan, wala pong tao na nayayapakan natin, wala pong tao na na nagkakaroon po ng problema sa atin. We just need between you and God, live righteous, walk right, talk right, live right. Amen. And the moment that God will give you trouble, Amen. God will give you trouble. Remind Him, Lord. Lord, di ba? Malakas ako sa'yo. Lord, if, if, if you don't know, if you don't like me, Lord, to live in this life, you can, you can take it. Because you give it away, and God, I mean, you give it, and God will take it away. Di ba? Kinakanta natin yan, mga praise and worship. It's just a matter of knowing God. If you know Him, brothers and sisters, ano man po mga troubles na dumating sa time frame mo, you have to accept and you have to understand that God has a wonderful plan for you. If God wants you to, to extend your life, so be it. Amen. Troubles might come. Maybe today, maybe tomorrow, maybe next week. But you have to prepare yourself, Church of God. Prepare yourselves. God will remind you, Ezekiah, King Ezekiah, wala pong exemptions. Afflictions may come and go. But at the end of the day, God will never leave you nor forsake you. Amen. Do you believe that, Church? Do you believe that, Church? Sa so, babalik po tayo, Sister Cherry, Sister Donna. Ha? Sorry po, hindi ko makuha yung mga, mga names ninyo. Brother James. Sister Marlene. Ha? Huwag ka na, alis. Amen. Kapag alam na po natin ang sikreto on how to live right, God will bless us. God will always bless us. Amen. Amen. Let's bow our heads and pray.
Come on, church. Let's worship the Lord. Amen, Lord God, Jesus. Thank you, Father God. Thank you, Father, Lord God, Jesus, for giving us your word. Thank you, Father, Lord, for strengthening us. Thank you, Father God, Lord Jesus, na ito pong salita mo ay naging blessing sa amin. We do believe, Father God, Lord Jesus, a lot of troubles may come our way, O Lord God, Jesus, but I do believe and we trust you, O Lord God, that you are allowing these things, Lord, and tinitignan mo po ang aming mga attitude on how to handle these such things, mga situation na ito. Lord God, strengthen us, O Lord God. Bigyan mo po kami ng kalakasan. Bigyan mo po kami, Panginoon, ng katatagan. And we believe, O Lord God, Jesus, that we can do all things through Christ who is strengthening us. Thank you, Father God, Lord, for giving us your word. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen, 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 and amen. God bless you, church. God bless you. Amen. So, isang napakagandang uh, paalala po sa atin ng ating Panginoon. Ang tunay nga ang habag ng ating Panginoon ay narito sa atin at tayo po'y magpatuloy lamang sa pag-serve at pag-worship sa Kanya at tayo po'y sumunod sa Kanyang mga salita. Amen. So, puri ng Diyos. Bless mo mong bawat isa. Amen. So, let's worship the Lord in spirit and truth. of our mission to teach in Jesus' name to share His goodness and righteousness by fighting in Jesus' name we worship in the Spirit we serve it all our hearts we declare that is our Savior we praise Him in one accord Great commission of our lives To teach the nation that Jesus Christ The Prince of Peace and Counselor Lord, Everlasting Father Almighty God Amen. The heartbeat of our mission To teach in Jesus' name To share His goodness and righteousness Baptizing in Jesus' name We worship in the Spirit We serve in all our minds We declare that it's our Savior We praise Him in one accord Great commission of our lives Exclamation that Jesus Christ brings to peace and cows along the last Father Almighty God. Great commission! Great commission of our lives. The insulation that Jesus Christ brings to peace and cows along the last Father. Almighty God, Almighty God, Almighty God. Amen. God bless us all.